CTV News at 6 with Joe Perkins. Good evening. Thank you for being here on this wet Sunday evening. We begin tonight with a remarkable story. It began this morning when two men in a homemade plane took off from the Nimo airport. Shortly after takeoff, problems issues so bad the plane went down, crashing into the water near Schooner Cove. It's where the two men were found floating, lucky to be alive. CTV's Jet Bassey has our top story. It landed somewhere here, less than a kilometer from the Schooner Cove Marina near Blunden Point, a homemade plane that took off from the Nanaimo Airport. They were going up to Gillies Bay on Texada Island. They got about, well, just about to Schooner Cove here. Um, he started to lose revs, and it appeared that his engine seized, and uh, so he had to ditch it in the water. At 9 a.m., Schooner Cove Marina's personnel heard a mayday call. They jumped in a boat and went to search for the downed aircraft. The plane was doing 45 knots when it hit the water. The impact did not injure the two passengers. They were able to quickly get out and watch the plane submerge. And they were wearing their zip up TFDs and uh, they were floating high when the Coast Guard, that was the first thing they saw were the orange uh, floaters. And they were in the water for about 25 minutes before the Coast Guard out of French Creek got them. The Coast Guard brought them to the marina. The staff quickly got the two passengers out of their wet clothes and warmed them up with cups of coffee. Uh, arriving here at the docks, we, we, we took them up to the office, gave, office, uh, gave them coffee and uh, some warm clothes and, and uh, dried them up. The men did not sustain any injuries from the crash. They got in a pickup truck and headed back to the Nanaimo airport. I think they were a little bit shaken up, but uh, they were no worse for the wear. They were okay. They said they were in the water for about 25 minutes. Uh, they are probably a little chilly, but uh, we warmed them up and, and uh, they were fine. Luckily for the two passengers, the French Creek Coast Guard was nearby to pluck them out of the water. I, I can't say enough about the uh, Coast Guard out of French Creek and, and the, the quick response that, that those guys are able to uh, come up with. We get lots of calls here at Schooner Cove. There's people in trouble all the time, and I'm just happy happy to know that the Coast Guard's there. The plane is lost, but the two men are glad to be found. A tragedy averted by the quick response to the French Creek Coast Guard. Jeff Bassey, CTV News, Nanus Bay.